Well, the first impression was going to be um, what everybody said about this hall before I got here. In what did you say? It was in 2004. So it's always a big, it, it's a very famous hall. And um, quite rightly so. So the first impressions are, wow, what's it going to be like? I, um, and I do remember the very first time. And it's, it's one of those sorts, you see, you, you never know, any musician never knows what it really sounds like in, for the audience. So you spend all your life thinking or hoping that what you do is, is, is going to come over there. And a really good hall gives you, even if you're not in the audience, it gives you the impression that you think you know how it sounds. And this is one of those halls. It's also very warm, acoustic, uh, not acoust acoustically, yes, but it's also the the um, the actual space, the, the 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 feeling of the space, the vibrations of the space. It's a very, it invites you to play, play music. So I I, I was a little bit, I, I was very excited about coming. Don't forget that that part of the the hall is the people in the hall and I think I think somehow I feel as though really good halls over their history they they soak up the the people who've been in them I think if you go into an old an old opera theatre or something you feel the souls of all these singers and all these players and it's the same it's, it's a much younger building only 30 years but you feel as though there's something very special about what's happened in this hall and that you feel on the stage and um, not only the place with its history but also of course the audience. I like very much the fact that certain types of repertoire need a certain type of hall but in all the pieces I've, whether it's a ch chamber piece or, or, uh, or Mozart or whether it's Bruckner or Mahler, big, the big pieces fit in just as well as the small pieces. And I think that is rather wonderful because it means then that what I hope to do in these next, uh, these next 10 years is to get as close as possible to this orchestra and to explore as many of the types of pieces that I think are are important in that development and they are not from one epoch. You know 30 years seems like a long time and it's very good to celebrate and uh, but it's it's just the beginning of this whole journey I think and um, already in 30 years if you, I'm sure if one looked at who which artists which which orchestras, which which conductors, which which musicians have played in this hall? It has a history and and, and, and a collective that is, it's such a, it's such a, 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 a fruitful place. I'm sure this hall just grows and grows. I think it gets better each time I go there. So, I wish the hall more more success.